The straight line solutions form a neat way to classify or visualize phase portraits for sinks, saddles, and sources. For example, a sink where both eigenvalues are negative, where base solutions are just decaying to the origin in both cases. Well, here all the arrows go into the origin. They kind of have this pitchfork shape where the dominant or larger eigenvalue stream kind of absorbs solutions. Let's say lambda 2 is the dominant here. Solutions get kind of sucked into that. And in the past, they must have looked like or similar to the weaker solution. A saddle, where one eigenvalue is negative and the other is positive, where I have decay on one stream and growth on another. Then the outbound solution is naturally dominant. I have solutions that drift from the incoming solution to the outgoing solution. I have this portrait that looks like a saddle surface, like a hyperbolic paraboloid from calculus. In a source, where both the eigenvalues are positive, where I have growth on both straight line solutions, and every solution is being driven outwards. And solutions are not really absorbed into the dominant solution. Let's say lambda 2 is dominant here. They're really following the dominant solution out. It's the exact same pitchfork shape as the first picture I drew above, but here all the arrows are reversed and solutions are going out. So focus on that pitchfork shape and the sink of the sink and source and the hyperbolic shape of the saddle. That helps you visualize where the dominant solutions are and where the general solutions follow.